folks, Species7 here. Welcome back to the channel. If it's your first time stopping by, thanks so much for checking it out. We're here today playing some Farm Sim 15, and we are on the Arches map, version 1.3. Yes, indeed. And, uh, just gonna take our harvester here and go in and tackle our first field. Oh, I forgot to turn the traffic back on. I will do that by next episode. So everybody really seemed in favor of uh, having a better, bigger look at this map, so that's exactly what we're gonna do. I have done a little bit of equipment changes. I know I did a sort of an intro to what we'd be using there yesterday. Um, the multi, the tractor, I have traded it in because I found a really nice um, class 720, or Fent 720, uh, or 716, well, one of the 700 models, you know how it goes. <laughs> and uh, that would be a little beauty right there, actually. And I also traded our trailer in. I've got... Uh, quite a pack of the AR stuff going on, so I thought we'd use it. Jeez, I guess right about now I'm kind of thankful I turned the traffic off. <laughs> Alright, 716. Really nice tractor, incredibly well done. Um, a little bit annoying in so much as it has the getting in the tractor animation, but that's kind of cool too, so uh, this is what I mean here. Right? Oddly enough, it's not actually letting me get in the tractor. Okay, this is really weird. Uh, hmm. That's really disturbing. Blah, 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 no. <laughs> okay, see, it seems to think that I'm actually uh, in the tractor. Let's turn that off. Uh, let's try getting rid of, what is it? E t -t 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 delete, I think? Yeah, skip, enter, animation, delete. Ah, there we go. Okay. Not sure why that was screwing up on us, but apparently it was. <laughs> Just because I said it was such a good mod, it decided to show me that, no, 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 I have issues. And that's why I'm not actually going to uh, throw all the links up until I've had a chance to use these things. Now, I mean, I drove it here, and I parked it, and I hooked a front weight to it, and those sort of things. However... <laughs> There's uh, no assurances that everything else will function flawlessly. All right, so I need to release that. Good. Now. And again, when it comes to the harvester, I don't think it would be that terribly believable to... Uh, get out there and manually pick it up and attach it anyways so <laughs> we're just going to do it from in there uh-huh well look at that there you go there's that animation i just turned off <laughs> unbelievable <laughs> oh lordy all right <laughs> okay well at least we know it's going to be one of those let play let's plays you guys are going to have lots to look forward to so, so far as script stuff, I have, um, I have the rock mod running, but I do not have the firewood mod, just because there's, um, I think a fair bit we need to do with the wood, and I'm not sure 
I mean, I'd like to run it. It'd be a great way to get quick early in-game money because we do still need gear. We don't have anything for potatoes, anything for sugar beets, um, you know, plus the sort of miscellaneous stuff that you always run into that you go, oh, all well, right, I forgot. Um, So yeah, we will be needing to come up with some money and relatively quick. Now I have all the beekeeping stuff ready to go, but I'd like to first see just how busy the map's going to make us. Now I know there are lots of functions on the map, and by how busy, I'm mainly thinking about time-wise. Um, I.e. do the fields take extra long to grow, do the greenhouses and those sort of things of course because we will be dealing with them, do those take any sort of extra time? Oh yeah I suppose, let's see what sort of emanations it's got. Alrighty, I think we'd actually just started to use the uh, wheeled version of this on the uh, gifts map hadn't we? Oh there you go, alrighty looking pretty funky now you ready oh you are all right we'll quickly run a headland up here oh let's have a look are you no you are enabled excellent because we do want straw yes yes we do all right nice animations Except that so it would appear I'm actually not as far over as I might want to be. So, oops. Well, we've made a nice mess of the straw now. Good, good. Off to a wondrous start. There we go. There we go. Now, <laughs> just me being me, and we're going to check it out in a minute. I decided that, you know, this, this, it looks like a muck map. You know what I mean? Like the way all these dirt roads and stuff, when you look at them, they look like they were designed to have, uh, the terrain mod running. So, just for the heck of it, I have, uh, put the old terrain zippy do into our mods folder. And we'll see what happens. If the tractors appear to do the terrain thing, then I'm going to assume that the author uh, just simply forgot to mention to add that. Because it's not the first time that would have happened. You know, where the actual function is built into the map, and it does seem to be almost a stock thing these days. Um, you know, and then the author puts up their description and uh, doesn't do it. Or I could just be really hoping <laughs> this is a muck map, and of course it won't be at all. Indeed. Alrighty. Now, I'm not sure here, actually, how much of a headland I'm going to be able to put on this end. I think we're probably pretty close to the back end there. So, so I wanted to come up that side instead of the other. Hope it would give us enough room, and it did. Awesome. Let's get one up here. And then we can start doing the backy and forthy. So I'm looking forward to uh, seeing how this map treats us. I hope you guys are too. As I said, everyone seemed fairly enthusiastic. Which is good. It's uh, one thing for me to really like something, but uh, if nobody else does, then it's not going to get any sort of views. And we know that just means it's going to disappear. Disappear. Like an old drunken, drugged out rock star. that thing sticking up in front of me. Let me guess, that's to put your cell phone on so you can take selfies while you're harvesting. <laughs> oh, I don't know, man. I, I just... That whole thing. 
Am I the only one that understands the level of narcissism involved or what, you know? <laughs> Why all of a sudden, man? You know? Wow. It's not like cameras are new technology. You know? So why all of a sudden is it such a thing to take your own picture? You know, that's just crazy. You kids these days. Right? <laughs> Alrighty. So yeah, there's uh, one of the available AR bodies right over there. And that's the trailer we're going to start with. I believe it's a Brantner trailer, possibly. Yeah, maybe not. As I said, I will uh, I will put links up when and if we figure out what stuff seems to work. Don't seem to have much issues with this harvester, but then again, I haven't done uh, you know such rare things as uh, disable the swath. I haven't tried uh, well. I haven't tried actually even emptying it. Truth be told, so who knows? That could turn out to be one of those horrible, horrible things. Oh, look at all the peanuts. Mmm. Should give me like a paper cup or something. No? Really? It's not for me to eat? Oh, kind of a rip off of that. Alright. Ding, 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 And yeah, I know. I could probably hire a worker to do this because this field is pretty much set up for it. And now that I've cut a headland. It's even more set up for it, but I do, 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 do have to uh, consider at the moment that it's not like I've got anything else to do. You know, what I do is stand at the side of the field and make sure old Billy Bob does straight lines. Yeah. I'm going to have to put that much effort into it. I'll just do it myself. Do, 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 do. Swing your combine round and round. Run the dang thing into the ground. Alrighty. Do 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 do. How are we doing here? 38%. Well, I feel that trailer is going to be sitting there until this field's done. I don't know what the cap is on this uh, combine. Not precisely. Ten thousand liters comes to mind, but I could be wrong. Although, yeah, that's starting to look that way too. If we actually look at our numbers down there, I think ten thousand liters might be right on the nose. compared to some of the older ones we've been using. Really smooth, powerful. Different. I have also uh, disabled that uh, extra camera mod that I used on old streams. In fact, I guess I... Oh no, that'll be a completely different mod folder. Um, that's the way I work my maps. Everything is done in its own entire folder, right down to the game XMLs, etc. That way I don't get bleed over. But, uh, yeah, I've disabled that because pretty much everything we're going to be dealing with on this map, we're going to be in cab. Well, for as much of it as we can, of course. But whenever we are in cab, I have found that Whenever you do a change in elevation, i.e. going up a hill or coming down a hill, you tend to stick your head through the roof, <laughs> and, uh, well, that gets old really quickly, believe it or not. So I think we'll just take a pass on it all together. <laughs> uh, I don't know if I'm going to get used to all of these square fields, though. Boy, oh boy. It's like a man don't even got to know how to steer. 
Well, there's all the fancy turning around part at the end of the field, I guess. Speaking of which, a couple more passes and we're done. Alrighty. And of course, when we call... Oh, um... Good, uh, good deal in pointing out, guys, that the cultivator that I was going to use, my 5-meter horse, was in fact a 10-meter horse, demanding um, massive amounts of pony power, which we simply don't possess, I suppose. Well, I guess I could hook the combine or gear up to it and pull it around the field, but beyond that, no. So, um, I have gotten rid of that. We've got, uh, well, I don't remember the name of it. But uh, we have a different one. Quite a colorful thing, actually. We could uh, throw some lights on it and put presents under it for Christmas, actually. It's uh, quite colorful. Like all yellow and red, green. But nice. And it is, in fact, a 6 meter. And only requires, well, either of the tractors that we own. So, thanks, guys. <laughs> uh, get out there and unfold the thing and realize first of all it's going to do the entire field in two passes and secondly of all that's only if I actually had something to pull it around. Maybe that little crass hopper I did on my missions with that would work like a hot dang. It's like 1200 horse or something. It's just a crazy man. You can actually use that for your entire farm. The only thing it doesn't do is uh, load grains. Like you need a trailer, but it will pull a trailer, any trailer. Stick a dolly on the back of it, it'll pull that 60,000 liter in-game trailer. So, yeah. All right, well, we did not fill this. Hmm. Looks like we'll be lucky to pull 7,500 liter here. But nevertheless, let's get our pipe out. I have no idea, I can't see it. There it is. Beautiful. Okay. Just hop out here. Oh, yeah. Pipe me now, dude. And, uh... Ah, uh, there's the tractor. So I did keep the Johnny Deer, however. And we will be using the John Deere. The Fent comes with its own uh, front loader. It also comes with uh, its own bucket. However, uh, that's the only tool it comes with. So I was a little bit worried that it only fit that bucket. But no, it does actually fit all of the standard in-game front loader tools. So, oh, right. to uh, just lift that rear linkage and I believe it's control Z I'm an idiot it's not apparently uh, bum, 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 bum. Uh, it is when you're yeah it is but only when you're actually like on the tractor so control Z there we go much better. All right. Like I said, I will. Uh, I will turn the traffic back on. Having it off on old streams is one thing, where there was only a couple of cars way the heck up the hill anyway. But uh, it does add a little bit of life to this map because they do go all the way around this little bit of road that is here. So makes it seem much better populated. Much better populated. You think I had no concept of the English language whatsoever? The detail on this thing. Oh boy. Got more stickers on it in the kids' coloring book. So, yeah, that is the AR dolly. Nice, very nice. Oh, it's a Brantner. There you go. Brantner trailer. 
Alright, don't know what I said. It might have even been that, but now we know for sure. Okay, somewhere around here is a combine with our name on it. There he is. Do -do 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 -do. So something very important that we've got to get right ricky ticky quicky is grass. Now I have the standard set of in-game mowers. I was going to go with the... Uh, there we go. The big... Uh, what the heck's it called here? As my brain just slowly crumbles into dust. There we go, this guy, the Case IH. I really like that, it works well, but I thought, you know what, let's, uh, let's work our way up to it, you know. We've got an awful lot of money riding on the kit we have. We also, of course, have got expenses to meet on all of that equipment, so we'll have to see how that goes. All right, thank you, sir. Off we go. All right, now where did we hide the silos? There they are. Look both ways, might as well get used to it. As I said, we will have traffic here eventually. All right, so just under, and I mean just under 7,500 liters. Eh? So there we go. Oop. A little bit of film fade, man. Eh? A little bit. canoe please excellent that's it huh <laughs> yeah alrighty there we, there we go indeed okay so here's some of the rest of our kit there's our uh, new cultivator of course there's a baler we're gonna actually need that right away this is the sprayer we'll be using, or trying out, and of course, like I said, the in-game cedars, at least for now. All right, let's, uh... For the moment, let's park this up. That'll do. <laughs> Zumba Goomba. All right, let's try this. Uh, map is made for muck theory. Yeah, I think it's just. Uh, just really wumpy bumpy terrain. Yeah, yeah I think so. That's ah, alright. I, I really would have uh, liked that as a bit of an addition to this. Guess you're just getting spoiled by having it on a lot of the maps that are being offered. Although, like I said, you never know. We might uh, might yet see another version of this come up the pike. And if so, I really hope that's something that's added. So here's... Uh... <laughs> here's the front loader. There you are. Pretty nice, huh? Really well done. And that's the bucket. And then, of course, I've got a pallet for it. Although a lot of what we're going to be doing uh, pallet-wise, I'm actually going to use a skid steer. Yes, indeed. Not something I've used in very many of my Let's Plays. Mainly because I do spend a reasonable amount of my time while in a skid steer. Well, quite frankly, spinning in circles. But we'll get to that when we can get to that. <laughs> and I know you're all, all looking forward to it. Um, that's amazing. I've managed to get lost. Um, 
I'm gonna go through here. <laughs> there we go. I'm just gonna take this over there. We still have to get the uh, combine dealt with. But, since that's where we're going, we may as well not go humpty handed. Oh, they're coming to get me. There's the Joni deer. Our other tractor. Which I'm sure is going to see a fair bit of use right quick. See, a good top end on this tractor, too doesn't hurt. Okay, are you off the road? There you are. There we go. Yeah, so all of you that were going, hey, you didn't hook up the PTL? Yeah, I know. I wasn't actually planning to use it. I need to uh, go and grab the trailer for our header first. So. There we go. We should be able to lift it that far. Yeah. Whoa. <laughs> oh, that's pretty funny. I didn't know you could do that. You can actually reach in and hit the gas pedal before you've climbed all the way into the tractor. Of course, I won't do that because you guys know me. I'd just fall right the heck back out again onto the ground. So... Probably not what I want to be doing. Interesting terrain for logging. I mean, we got this simple stuff here, but first of all, these trees look kind of stumpy, so I think they need some growing up. But uh, we got some neat ones going up the hill. That's going to be some tough stuff to deal with. Very cool. Very cool indeed. Pipe in. Uh, I guess we might as well fold it up. It's going to be a little while before we need to need any more there we go you can see it all folding up and it's locked perfect let's head over and dump this off Usually these guys are set up that you can go center of the wheels. But I've actually found with this one it's a little bit off of that. That's okay. I'm gonna do it anyway. Alright, let's have a look here. That's, looks pretty good. And that. Yeah, not bad at all. Alrighty. Let's set her down. Ooh. Ooh, ooh, ooh. We're not quite on there at all. That looked alright, but... Okay, let's try that. better. That was off a little bit. Let's get that locked down. 
There we go. All right. Quickly zip this back in. I don't really want to leave my combine out in the middle of the yard. You can see I did move the karsher. Plesha washa. So it's actually by the uh, water. Oh, and uh, let's have a look here. Which way is which other way? Hmm, okay. Um, I did find out where the water source is, and that's where my water trailer. So, oh, that was the other thing we need to buy, though. The fuel trailer, whoops. So, I think we'll get the in-game one. It's nice and small, as opposed to, like, another universal tank or something. All right, now. Uh, hopefully this will work. Let's see if this thing has the... All right, nice. And is there a script release somewhere else along here, then? Can I do this one from... Apparently not, eh? Okay, well that's alright. With any luck at all, that means it'll keep it locked on there. <laughs> Always worth looking. Alright. So grass mowing is going to be next, but I think I'm actually going to use the Johnny Deer for that. So we will get to that ever presently. For the moment, shut her down, put the brake on, and get out of her. There we go. Alright, I'm going to go and collect up me combine and park it back. I park it right in there most of the time. So, I uh, hope you guys enjoyed the first actual farming episode here on the Arches version 1.3 map. I certainly enjoyed it. And, uh, well, this is PC7 for Farm Sim 15. Remember to like, share, and subscribe. Till next time, guys. Ooh, all the cows skip in the future. One foot. Go. Take care of each other, folks. And <laughs> ciao for now. Uh, Farm Sim 15. The delightful weirdness of it.